Hi, this is Tisha Copeland at Not Your Mama's Quilt Store, and I want to show you this great tool by Clover called a dome threaded needle case. And this is where you have several needles that are threaded and ready for you to use, perfect for when you're doing stuff like English paper piecing, or maybe having to do um, hems, or binding, anything like that that you don't want to mess with threading a needle over and over again. So what is it? Let me show you how cool this is to use. It comes in a package like this, and it actually has a dome cover. You just pop this off like this. Right here, there are little tiny slots in here that maybe you can see. They're little tiny slots. See how close they are? And then there are some more cutouts right here, and there is a slot right here, okay? So what you do is you thread all your needles that you're going to want. It holds up to 10 of them. You slide it into that little slot right there. And I'm gonna push it with this because it hurts my fingernail to push it. Then you put the thread in this other little slot like that. Now, all you do is turn it with your finger and wind it. And the thread goes all the way wound up around the inside, just like that. Now we're ready to do the next one. So I'm gonna line back up with the next one right there. Here is my next needle. It's going to go right here. I'm gonna put it in there, there we go. I'm just gonna push this back right there with my finger. Put it in that other little slot again and just twist it up, okay? I don't have to do anything else except twist it up. Now it works better if you don't knot your threads right now, knot them as you take them out to use them. If you knot them, they tend to catch on each other and I'll show you what I mean in just a minute. Here's my next threaded needle. It's gonna go all the way in there, just like that. Goes into this little slot right here. Twist it up. And now I've got three needles with thread ready to go. I can put my cover on this and I'm ready to take it wherever I need to go work or throw it in my purse or whatever I'm gonna do. So to take your needles out now, all you do is take your cover off. You're going to get, it doesn't matter which one you pull, but if you can pull the last one, but it really doesn't matter. All I'm gonna do is pull out my needle from the slot and I can just pull out my thread just like that. I'll show you this one because this is the other one. And I can pull out my thread just like that. Here's the next one. Ready to go. And so I can use them as I put them in, I can take them out the same way. If for whatever reason it gets knotted up, which I've never had it knot up underneath, you have a little slot right here, just grab a coin and turn it, and this part will come out right here, and you can just lift it. And so now I can take it out if I need to untangle my threads, but I've never had that happen before. It's pretty easy to do. Put it back together. You'll kind of feel it set into place and then just get your coin. It has the little open engraved on there. I don't know if you can see that right there. And I'm going to turn it the opposite way. There we go, turn it the opposite way. And now it's locked again. So I'd be able to keep all my needles in there. This is really, really, really nifty when you're having to thread a bunch of needles and you don't wanna to stop to do it every single time. So this is the dome threaded needle case available by Clover, but of course I have it here in the store at Not Your Mama's Quilt Store. So come on by and see us. This is Tisha Copeland. Thanks for checking in.